Hi guys, I'm going to show you today how to assemble normally um, just a drawer. Now I have six drawers. This is basically two unit joined together. Hope you enjoyed the video. Yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always, and let's do the job now. And we're starting with the bottom drawer. We're gonna build two same drawers and then we're gonna connect them together. So this is two side panels, three screws on each side panel and two wooden plugs on a dividing panel. Position the side panels to the right way and we can place the dividing panel. Tap it in and secure it with the three metal locks point the arrow in the right direction and secure the locks. You can place the other side panel and secure it with the three metal locks, exactly the same. Don't forget the arrow in the right direction and secure the locks. The front rail is gonna secure the front of the drawer and we can prepare the rails, you can secure them on the side panels there's a two screws through the rail, one at the front, one on the back. The front is the third hole and the back one is the last hole on the rail. You're gonna have three rails on each of the side panel. There's three left and three right rails. Locks on the bottom of the side panels, there's gonna be two locks on each side panel. And we can prepare the drawers now. It's gonna be three drawers, so we're gonna have six side panels, three left and three right. And place the plastic locks on it, two on each side panel. And this is the front panel of the drawer, four screws, two on each side. And place the side panels. Secure the locks bottom of the drawer, place it in and place the other side panel, secure it with two plastic locks and the back of the drawer. You see how I put it then in, you have to go slightly on the side and then slide it in. Four plugs two on each side secure the drawer. Can place the drawer in there is the hook at the back it has to come in the hole of the back of the drawer and at the front there is a hole under it it has to come in as well cover the holes the back of the drawer with the plastic caps second drawer exactly the same four screws two plastic locks on the side panels bottom of the drawer side panel secure the side panel and the top of the drawer secure it with the four plastic plugs and we can place the drawer in hook it at the back there it is and secure the front so it's a hole on the both sides place the plastic caps Close the holes at the back of the drawer from inside, and this is the last drawer. Exactly the same things four screws, front panel, secure the side panels, and the top uh, back of the drawer. Place it in, same things, hooks at the back, click it in, and the front. And the first drawer is done. There is the locks for the drawer. Place them in the first hole and secure it. Use one on each side of the drawer, so each drawer have a two of them. Rubber stickers to prevent the drawer against slamming or to be loud when it closing at the end. And we can start to do the bottom panel. You have four adjustable legs. Place them in. Good stuff if you have uneven floors. Four screws. Place them in and we can put the bottom panel in. There's two wooden plugs on each side panel as well. 
secure it the drawer should be out at this point the bottom one so we can secure the locks there's two locks on each of the side panel just twist the lock and the bottom panel is secured and the bottom drawer is done we're gonna have two exactly the same drawers so we're gonna connect them together I have the second one ready I'm not gonna do it again because it's exactly the same so with the second one just follow exactly the same things so what we did with the first one just without bottom panel so we have four wooden plugs we're gonna join them together and we're gonna have a screw with the two uh, two heads secure them with the locks don't twist the locks at this point completely just one quarter in so the screw not gonna come out but it's still flexible coming up and down you can place the second drawer on the top find the holes where is the screws the connecting screws place it in it's a bit tricky so the drawer is quite heavy that's it we find the holes secure it with the four locks at this point you can tie up all the locks the top and bottom ones so we're gonna have four on each side connecting the bottom drawer and top drawer together this is the top panel four screws two on each side two wooden plugs on each of the side panel and we can place the top panel in find the right holes place it in tap it all in make sure everything is lining up nicely and we can secure the locks from inside there's two locks on each of the side panel twist the lock and lock it all top panel you're gonna have two kind of strings on the top this is secure we can secure the drawer on the wall the drawer is fairly tall so we prevent the drawer falling down when we open all the drawers and we can place the drawers in we have them ready so exactly the same like on the bottom Place the drawer, secure it at the front with the two plastic locks. These hooks at the back have to come to the hole, the back panel. And this is the last one, the top. And the drawer is done. And this is it. Another chisel drawer from IKEA. Hope you enjoyed the video. If yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Made my day. And see you in my next one very very soon. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful day.